Instamatic. Anywho, let's move on to something that's new. Gund teddy bears. Mm. Did you grow up with them? You know what? They're just so, no, I didn't, but I wish I would have. You know what? That'd probably be the answer to my question that I asked on Facebook. Which was what? What did you want growing up that you never really I got? got. I remember growing up and like going to FAO Schwartz, like if we were on vacation in New York City, and seeing the gun teddy bears. Mm -hmm. They date back to 1898. Like they are the original America's most huggable bear. Obviously since then, they have moved on to other amazing plush toys, which is exactly their kind of hallmark claim to fame. This is called the My Pet Puddles animated plush puppy. It's from Gund. It debuted new today. Hang on, let me just turn him on so you can be wowed by what he does. And also, I don't mind saying, let me invite in um, our guest. Um, oh no, we're getting her ready, so stand by. Okay, so this is um, available on Easy Pay. It's perfect for ages one and up. And it's so darling. They, they the gun company, make these animated, oh, make these animated plushies and they're not like, hard, uncomfortable robotic toys. They're like a stuffed animal that comes to life. And you have to provide the batteries. No, that's a lie. You get the batteries, sorry. Three double A, Elizabeth Werner, three double A batteries. They come, oh, he's a little puppy. And by the way, Elizabeth, well done you, because I hear half of our quantity was sold through today. Everybody looking for that puppy that does not require potty training for Christmas. Thank you, <laughs> the end. <laughs> That's exactly right. And this little guy, so sweet. You hear some sweet sounds, but let me tell you how that magic works, Sean. This sweet little puppy actually has sensors built in throughout. So as our little ones pet him on the head, going down the back, you're going to not only hear him whimper and bark and see his little tail wag. If you turn him around, you'll see his tail wag. Look at that little wiggle wiggle. So our little ones learn as they nurture that the dog responds by poking his little head, wagging his cute little tail. His lick oh, is particularly you know juicy. Yes. Yes. So if you touch his little nose to your face or anywhere on you, he's going to either give you a kiss or you're going to hear a little slurp. <laughs> yeah, it's very slurpy. I like it. Very slurpy. So your little one gets to elicit all these fun responses by just snuggling up and petting this adorable puppy. And this is brought to us by Gun. And Sean, you and I are huge Gun fans because they're always soft and squishable and huggable. Their personalities are always so sweet. I mean, look at the little face on this guy. Even if he wasn't moving around and barking and wagging that cute little tail, you'd fall in love with him. But the fact that he does so much really is what makes our little ones fall in love with him the same way we do. So I have many thoughts on this, including I would hurry because it debuted new today and it's already half sold through. It's not going to ship until... <laughs> It's not going to ship until August 31st, which is fine. Um, I I will just also say it's funny that Elise is here tonight because I forget your your baby's name. Milo. Milo. Okay, yeah. so Elise obviously has a really strong love connection with her little boy Milo. And I grew up with dogs, Elizabeth, but I don't have one now because Joe doesn't want, like, another another thing he has to clean up after. But I will tell you, even, even as a plush toy, this animated category, Elizabeth is on The View in the Today Show all the time with toys, especially this time of year. So she always knows the hottest things going. Elizabeth, when you get toys that children, even from ages one up, can interact with, they interact and the yeah. toy responds, it is so stimulatory for their brains. It's amazing. That's right. The whole cause and effect thing, well, they don't even know that they're learning as they're playing. That's the beauty of play. Our children are learning, they're imagining. And with this little one, they're nurturing. So we want to teach our children to nurture. And some of them do that in different ways. But a puppy, it doesn't matter who you are. When you see a puppy, you melt. But as adults, we melt and our children melt. Well, this one is designed for ages one and up. So safe for the little ones. I hear that little slurpity slurp going on. That's one of the sensors. So the sensors on this puppy, you've got the nose right there. Give, it, give that little nose Just keep a, doing that. A rub. You're going to... 
Yeah, little, that you're getting kisses. I mean, what could be better than a kiss? <laughs> yes. Uh, oh, and, he's so, and he's super lovable. Like, I'm going to be part. honest. The first generation of these animated toys, I feel like the minute you tried to cuddle right. with them, you could feel all the mechanics on the inside, and it was so not pleasurable. He is just, he's yes. a love muffin, really. He is. So, I want <laughs> You're loving those kisses. You might end up with a puppy after this. I have a, I have a feeling. Well, can you At write to I'm Joe? I'm not going to be the only ones. Ooh, Ooh is that what you always wanted? Didn't get it? One of the things. Yeah. Yeah. I wait. Can I just tell everybody? Speaking oh. of puppies. Um, and by the way, thank you, Elizabeth. Snoopy's on the way. I feel like there's a very heavy so dog theme to this show. Yeah. <laughs>